far as I know, that's actually a really good fishing pole. The party would be over, but no, 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 the party is here, and we're gonna keep it going. I'm Mr. Lysak, and today we are going magnet fishing. That's right, magnet fishing underneath this bridge. Now with this bridge, I have scuba dove, 101 feet to the bottom, got a little nervous, didn't dare venture out into the center, so I have no idea what is under there. As a result, today I have rigged up not just the magnet fishing we're gonna be doing, but we have the Paralens dive camera, which by the way, we are sponsored by Paralens. Other side, the tentacles on the other side. Oh, it's over here. Yeah. Which by the way, we are sponsored by Paralens, which, which, which will show you the depth, the depth, the <laughs> I'm just really messing this up today, aren't I, Kiara? So we want to give a big shout out to Paralens, who has provided us with the dive camera that is going to show you guys the depth. That's right. We're gonna see just exactly how deep it is underneath this bridge, and we're gonna be recording all of it with, look, I already said what we're gonna be recording it with, with the Paralens. So, in the description below, check out Paralens, who is the sponsor of this video, as well as Orca Torch, who has been kind enough to send us the 4200 Lumi Lumi flashlight. Woo! That thing's gonna blind you. Oh, sorry, Kira. Oh, dear. All right, look at that. Our first catch of the day, Kira. Already got ourselves a guardrail. Plus, we also want to thank Brute Magnetics. They've sent me two magnets. We used the 1,000 pound pull in another video. This is the 1,200, which is actually only like 600 per side, but this is a pull magnet. So instead of doing a little boop, boop, boop method we did, the little boop, boop, boop method we did last time, we're gonna do the drag method this time. Do you wanna tell the audience why the magnet's no longer its original silver color? It is no longer silver because I had an incredible tip from one of our subscribers and viewers that said, hey, Mr. Lysak, if you paint your magnet black, it will not shine and blow out as much with that amazing 4200 Lumi Lumi Orca Torch flashlight on there. We're gonna see how it works. Brute Magnetics, thank you. Thanks for sending us this, uh, oh, what is it? Oh, it's a fishing magnet. Thanks for sending us the fishing magnet so we can go fishing today. I'm oh, sorry, I keep blinding you, don't I? Yeah. All right, oops, oh, hold oh. on, wait a minute. Oh my goodness. That's a strong magnet. Ah! Okay, Kira, bad idea. <laughs> oh, already stuck. Oh my God. You got it stuck two other times already. Yep. You can't get it this time? Uh, uh, maybe. Don't hit yourself. Oh, okay. We got it. Now, another little tippy trick. When you go magnet fishing, make you sure you get yourself a rope that is strong enough that it will not break. This is paracord here. It's rated up to 750 pounds. Was it recording? It is recording. Oh good. All right, back down we go. Woo! Here we go. All right, down to the bottom. Did we find the bottom? Let me see. Careful. I'm not sure we found the bottom of that. Yeah, yeah, that's the bottom. All right. Wish me luck. Good luck. Thanks. I don't want to drop it. Well, unfortunately, the magnet fishing was a little bust this morning. Not because it was a broken magnet, but because it was like really, really silty 108 feet down. So, we're gonna come back here where I did magnet fishing a couple weeks ago, and I know there's at least one, maybe two radios, a phone, a fishing pole. This one will not be a bust, guaranteed. All right, feel her. I'm digging through the sub box. I thought I had a map in here. The driver's door doesn't lock. I bought the car my junior year. There's candy in my backpack. And you can pick our soundtrack. We're heading for the East Coast tonight. So pack your bags and hold on tight. Cause we're taking off. Pack up here. Pack is in. Pack up here. In. Pack here. In. Pack up here. In. Get in. Back coast. Hold back there. In. Run away with me. We're on the way to New York City. Take my hand and see. Manhattan never looks so pretty. Travel light and see the world right. You'll never know if you never go. 
and say hello to New York City. And say hello to New York City. And say hello to New York City. Feet up on the dashboard. We're driving with the windows down. Did you forget your phone cord? left a spot. I've already got two radios, a phone, some sunglasses and a hat, the fishnet, down for more. I know I'm running 
away from moments What am I becoming? I guess something's broken As far as I know, that's actually a really good fishing pole. And on top of those other two radios we already found, I found two, maybe three, maybe four more, I don't know. There's so many tires down there too. Today's not the day I'm gonna be getting tires. No, why not? Well, yeah, the dumpster isn't down here and the water is just so clear. I'm kind of enjoying like a nice relaxing dive. There's a ton of garbage. And even that, I'm leaving a lot of that behind today. Just because I'm enjoying more of the swim. So I apologize that I'm not getting all the garbage and all the tires. It'll be here next time. And the time after that. And the time after that. And after that. And after that. Get it started! And another nice bag of garbage and treasures. There's some tools in here too. The party's over here, the party's over there. The party's just over here. I am really excited that we came back over here to the marina because it's incredible everything that we found. Um, an element, do you even know what that is? No. I don't know what that goes to. 
We got another battery out of the lake, a bungee cord, more bottles and cans, a little silverware, including we, um, do we can need a new, opener. Yeah, do we need a new can opener up at the house? Not that one. Uh, it's <laughs> actually not working either. We found a Verizon phone, a carbon monoxide alarm, we beat our record on radios. Last time we were down here, Jason and I, we found seven radios. This time, we found eight more radios, bringing our total haul to eight plus seven, 15. See, I'm really, I'm really good at third grade math, right? Or is that second grade? No, that's first grade math, right? Today is the day. Mr. Don Fassbender has a YouTube channel. He is another river treasure diver, and he told me that if I found him some Oakleys, that he's gonna send me, what was it, ice cream, right? So Don Fassbender, I am cashing in on your little uh, offer. So whether you want these Oakleys, or where's that other pair of Oakleys at, Kiera? I know that I found another pair of Oakleys. There we go. So you get that pair of Oakleys or that pair of Oakleys, Mr. Fastbender, or I think that's it. I got some Ray-Bans in here too. Two Ray-Bans. Two Ray-Bans today. So I'm looking forward to trading in these Oakleys or these Oakleys for some incredible Wisconsin ice cream. Thanks, Don. We'll be catching up with you soon. And you would think that after a short 35, 40 minute dive, the party would be over, but no, 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 the party is here, and we're gonna keep it going by telling you about the not one, not two, but three watches we got today. We got the Fit, I think that's a Fitbit. Is that a Fitbit, Kira? I don't know. So, maybe a Fitbit. No idea what brand that is. Definitely not, I, I don't think it's Rolex. Seems pretty light. No real name brand, plus the silver comes off and it's just like a little copper cop or something or underneath. Another watch, couple of lighters, a little tubey tubey of some lip balm or something, something like that. I think it's all, I mean, it's all gone. But is that like a lip gloss little ball there, Kira? Uh, I don't know. I don't know either. It could be a roll on perfume. We also got a game piece for, uh, Upwards, is that the name of the game? So the G for upwards, some lighters, more lighters, more lighters, the bottom of a little fishing reel, and another incredible, I wonder if this will even cast. I'll tell you what's gonna happen. I'm gonna cast this out there, yeah. and the moment that I cast it, a ranger's gonna come by, and he's gonna be like, hey, you cannot be casting and fishing in the marina here. I'm like, sir, there's no hook on there. You're like, I don't care. Woo, it actually still works. That's a good reel. Look at that. Do, 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 do. I'm a fishing. I've been magnet fishing today. I've been diving. And I have now been fishing in the marina with no hook. That's a nice little, uh, what is that? Comment below. An Abu Garcia. FLW. Does anybody know if that's a good reel? Does anybody have one of those reels? Let me know in the comment section down below. Today's been a good day. Oh, let's see. If we got tired of fishing for any reason, we could put our little crawdad trap together, do a little crawdadding. The party's still going, so hang tight, because now we're gonna go down to the lower bench here where I'm gonna show you the mag light. Remember when mag lights were like all the thing back in the day? Like you were not anybody unless you had a mag light. You had a mag light, you were kind of cool. Sometimes you'll see me eat some cheese. However, Kristen has forbid me from eating this cheese today. No idea why, but I think I just might listen to her today. We got a hose nozzle, a screwdriver, a crescent wrench, another crescent wrench, a pair of vice grips. Uh, let's see, we got a half inch wrench. We got a quarter inch uh, socket, no, not a socket, what is that called? Um, um, a ratchet, we got a quarter inch ratchet is what that one is. Oh, it's Craftsman too. So with Craftsman, I can take this in, they'll give me a new one. Also got ourselves a little buck knife, a 10 millimeter husky. Oh, I forget what this is called. No, not an exact knife, it's a um, cutter. Um, yeah, yeah, a little razor blade knife is what that is. Some super glue, if we need to glue anything back together. Little cooler mount, I think, is what that is. Goes on a cooler. No idea. Ooh, this is good. A nice little uh, pry bar. So that one's good. Carabiner, a bag we don't need. Some pole holders for your boat. 
and some more boating accessories, such as the gas caps and, you know what I could do anytime I find a whistle, Kira? <laughs> Blow it in our ears. Yeah, something like that. More boating straps, no idea what that is. The edge of a, that goes on like the end of the, um, oh, what's it called? The docks, that goes on like on the corner of it, so helps protect the end of it. And a little bit of garbage. This is not the thumbnail, Kara. This is just me telling everybody, hey, if you've not already subscribed, do so right now. And turn on that little bell notification right down there below. That way you get an instant notice anytime we upload another video just like this one. That's it for now. Later, later. Bye-bye.